The Life and Sad Ending of Tom Bosley Thomas Edward Bosley was born October 1, 1927 in Chicago, Illinois. Bosley was the son of Dora and Benjamin Bosley, and they were Jewish. He attended Lakeview High School in Chicago and served in the U.S. Navy during World War II. While attending DePaul University in Chicago in 1947, he made his stage debut in Our Town with the Canterbury Players in the Fine Arts Theater. Bosley performed at the Woodstock Opera House in Woodstock, Illinois in 1949 and 1950 alongside Paul Newman. Bosley played the Knave of Hearts in a Hallmark Hall of Fame telecast of Eva Le Gallien's production of Alice in Wonderland in 1955, but his breakthrough stage role was as New York Mayor Fiorello H. LaGuardia in the long-running Broadway musical Fiorello in 1959, for which he won a Tony Award. Bosley's first motion picture role was in 1963 as would-be suitor of Natalie Wood in Love with the Proper Stranger. Other films include The World of Henry Orient, Divorce American Style, Yours, Mine, and Ours, Gus, and the made-for-television The Triangle Factory Fire Scandal. Bosley shared a heartfelt story about his own experience with the Holocaust in the documentary film Paperclips. Among his early television appearances was in 1960 on the CBS Summer Replacement series Diagnosis Unknown with Patrick O'Neill. In 1962, he portrayed Assistant District Attorney Ryan in the episode The Man Who Wanted to Die on James Whitmore's ABC legal drama The Law and Mr. Jones. Also in 1962, Bosley played Teddy opposite Tony Randall and Boris Karloff in Arsenic and Old Lace, for the Hallmark Hall of Fame. About this time, he was a guest star on the NBC police sitcom Car 54, Where Are You? He also appeared on episodes of Bonanza, Bewitched, Get Smart, The Silent Force, The Streets of San Francisco, Night Gallery, A Touch of Grace, and The Love Boat. In 1969, Bosley appeared in a comical episode of The Virginian entitled Crime Wave in Buffalo Springs, appearing alongside fellow guest stars James Brolin, Yvonne DiCarlo, Carrie Snodgrass, Gary Vinson, with Virginian regulars David Hartman and Doug McClure. Among myriad television appearances, one notable early performance was in the Eyes segment of the 1969 pilot of Rod Serling's Night Gallery, directed by Steven Spielberg and starring Joan Crawford. Bosley's best-known role was the character Howard Cunningham in the sitcom Happy Days that aired first run on the ABC network from January 15, 1974 to September 24, 1984. The series was one of the most successful of the 70s. Also, at this time, he portrayed Sheriff Amos Tupper in Murder, She Wrote and the eponymous Father Frank Dowling on Father Dowling Mysteries. He was nominee for Primetime Emmy for Outstanding Continuing Performance by a Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series for Happy Days in 1978. In 1977, he appeared in the miniseries Testimony of Two Men, and in 1978, he played the role of Benjamin Franklin in the television miniseries The Bastard, a role he replayed the following year in the sequel The Rebels. His Film appearances included roles in Love with the Proper Stranger, 1963, The World of Henry Orient, 1964, Divorce American Style, 1967, The Secret War of Henry Frigg, 1968, The Night That Panicked America, 1975, The Triangle Factory Fire Scandal, 1979, O'Hara's Wife, 1982, and Million Dollar Mystery, 1987. Bosley starred in the 2008 Hallmark Channel television movie, Charlie and Me. In 2010, he appeared in The Backup Plan and Santa Buddies, which were his final films. In 1984, he guest-hosted the Macy's 4th of July fireworks spectacular with local newscaster Pat Harper. With voiceover roles, Bosley was known for his unique gravelly voice, leading to a number of voice acting roles. He narrated the syndicated television documentary, That's Hollywood, 
From 1976 to 1982, he hosted the General Mills Radio Adventure Theater, a 1977 radio drama series for children. He voiced many cartoon characters, including Harry Boyle in the animated series Wait Till Your Father Gets Home. Bosley was the voice of B.A.H. Humbug in the 1978 Rankin and Bass holiday special The Stingiest Man in Town. He provided the voice of the title character in the 1980s cartoon The World of David the Gnome and the shop owner Mr. Winky in the children's Christmas special The Tangerine Bear. In his personal life, Bosley was married to Jane Elliott from 1962 until they divorced in 1978. Later, in 1980, Bosley married former actress Patricia Carr and they stayed married until his death. Bosley had a daughter. Amy Bosley. Sadly, Bosley died from complications of a staph infection on October 19, 2010, at a hospital in Rancho Mirage, California, near his home in Palm Springs. He was 83 years old. Bosley had been battling lung cancer. He was survived by his wife, Patricia Carr, and their daughter, Amy. He was interred at Forest Lawn Memorial Park, Hollywood Hills Cemetery.